a little sailboat there. And right here is the Santa Ana Cathedral that I showed up close in some of my previous videos and the Atlantic Ocean beyond it. Quite a view here. Really colorful homes and buildings there. And so I'm uh, on the island of Gran Canaria, the city of Las Palmas de Gran Canaria is uh, out there. And as you can see, a cloudy day. And so I didn't do one of the adventures that I was uh, thinking of doing today, like going to uh, one of the cool beaches. And so I just decided to head off and just do some random exploring. I wasn't really planning to film today and then saw these cool views and was like, okay, I gotta catch this. This is really interesting uh, exploring here. And so I'm just going to wander up this way, see where it goes, try to get some more views and find some more um, cool things here on the Canary Islands. They are just really Exquisite. Por favor, no aparcar, gracias. No parking, please. Thank you. I just love this style of, you know, kind of a little bit uh, uh, funky and worn down, yet simultaneously colorful and interesting. Head up here, Calle Fresa. That sounds kind of like strawberry, except that it is spelled differently. <laughs> Calle Fragua. This is uh, almost feeling a little bit Greek islandish these tiny little lanes with nobody around. Definitely a different style, but uh, you know, it's still a um, island of Southern Europe, so has that in common. And there is the Santa Ana Cathedral again. And some colorful laundry. Funny, some leftover Christmas stuff. I wonder if that was just painted for the Christmas season or looks like it must stay there all the time. It's kind of funny to have the Santa right there and then the uh, Santa graffiti <laughs> right here. Definitely some killer views. Again, the Santa Ana Cathedral, that is where I basically started walking from. Pretty cool. Didn't know what to expect for today, but definitely pleasantly surprised. And you may have noticed I'm using my old Olympus camera here. Um, no reason, just. Kind of felt like it. Perfumeria. Cafeteria, hamburgueseria, pizzeria. Just eat, okay. Veterinaria. And it looks like here I'm going to get some more views of the um, other side of the island, sort of. And so I had remarked in one of my other uh, videos about these uh, palm trees and how there are no coconuts up there. And somebody commented that it is because they are uh, date palms and not cocoa palms. So 
that explains it. Another awesome view. And another amazing view. And check this out. It looks like some sort of very ancient uh, walls and um, carvings into those caves there. So I really have no idea, but the Spanish arrived in uh, the Canary Islands in 1402 was when they basically uh, first arrived here and started uh, taking over the island from the indigenous people that lived here uh, prior to that. And so who knows, that could be as old as five to six hundred years if it was one of the original uh, things that the Spanish constructed like aqueducts and um, terraces for uh, gardening, uh, farming and stuff like that. Just a wild guess. Heading down some steep steps here. Just going downhill from here and uh, try to get back to the main uh, center of the city. Oh, here I am back at the uh, Santa Claus. And heading down a slightly different way here. Different street, Calle Fama. But it seems to be heading in the uh, right direction. I'll just try to get down to uh, down there somewhere. And here you can see more of these old walls and terraces. Definitely curious to know the uh, history here. And check it out, folks. Up close with the uh, ruins here. Okay, now this doesn't look that old. This looks like more modern concrete. So maybe they aren't as old as I thought. But this could be different from that other stuff anyways. Trippy. Yeah, this appears to be a tunnel created for going underneath the uh, freeway there. It's kind of stinky in here. Interesting though, lots and lots of uh, sort of mediocre graffiti. As I said before, strawberry, I think strawberry is fris, fris, something like that. Whereas that street was fresh up. I don't know, maybe it's the same.
and back in town. And this shop looks more like Amsterdam. I'm not sure what the deal is with uh, weed in Spain, if it's uh, legalized or what. I know that it is in Portugal. They completely uh, decriminalized all drugs in Portugal. I think it's pretty loose in Spain. I'm not sure. Feel free to uh, enlighten me below what exactly is going on there. Uh, if you're you know, able to buy actual ganja there or if it's just like a pipe shop or what. I'm not sure. And just around the corner from the weed shop, we got a church. Plaza San Francisco. Feels almost like home. I'm from Northern California north of San Francisco a little bit. And so that is the Santa Ana Cathedral that we kept seeing from a distance. So I'm back in the uh, center of Las Palmas de Gran Canaria. Um, I've already shown a lot of this uh, in a few of the other videos that I posted. So going to uh, finish this video up here. Um, stay tuned, lots more coming from the Canary Islands. Hasta luego. Street yoga. Ominous rumors have been privately circulated. Insane. A very special kind of device. <laughs> the doomsday is 